All right, Dave, people have seen my, uh, my house possibly before, but they haven't seen it on the high quality Im image stabilizer camera. So go in, all right? And let's see what, let, let's see what damage it, it had here. All right, these are the wheelchairs. Here, explain the story of the wheelchairs. These Dave, are the wheelchairs at home. we picked off the street in Herring Avenue after the hurricane. Where were they, where were they at? By the CVS and down by No, the I'm saying, but where were they stored? They were stored in the Herring Avenue shower. The shower, which is now kaput. The floor had fallen that's out right. in some of the chairs. Dave, that, that glass cabinet, that, that, that's from one of my glass uh, things that are not damaged. A lot of things are damaged in here. I'm going to gonna reuse I'm gonna reuse that coffee pot. You are? No, I wouldn't use that. They're a dog fight. Use... I wouldn't serve that on the sidelines of a dog let's fight. See, they all rest. I've them. thrown away nicer than that. Here, let's see. This old bike... This old bike somebody left out in front of the house, and I used it right before the hurricane, and I had used it one time. I drove to... It's the ricketyest old bike, but I put it in here figuring... Where I don't know. What are these parking signs? Park? Well, what do you, what do you think? You're take them back? What business is my brother in? Here. And look, my Halloween lights are... I gotta better take these down. These are still in good condition. Yeah, I wouldn't need these. No. They were, all, they were always in good condition. I've had those for years. They're purple and, and orange. But I put up a half... The Electrolux was saved from you know. the showers. Oh, that's... We gotta take that. Oh, Dave, this is my favorite chair here. I need some old English to clean this yeah, up I again. Yeah, I took this out. This is, the, um, this is a beautiful chair. I love that chair. I'm gonna take that table. I'm gonna take, naturally, the... the, uh, the look at my floors. I'm, I'm gonna take this fine table here. Are you taking No! this TV? It's a piece of... Yeah, I'm gonna take this old TV. Looks like it, it threw off the side of the Titan. Don't you have to return these to cable vision? I'll return them to cable vision. There's a couple of them. Whatever. There's been a natural disaster. I don't think they really care. I wouldn't leave them here. The, um, but you got to return them before Eddie comes back. All right. Well, whatever. The um, I, I have all week to return the cable boxes. Yeah, I'm going to keep all my food in the cabinets, too. That yeah. that taco dinner, I'm gonna keep that. This is such a dump. How could I have lived in such a crap hole here? What a dump! Yeah, really. Look, I, Dave, I still I, I I didn't want I didn't wash the dishes before I left. I just left the dishes in the sink, and it looks like a science experiment is growing here. I ripped ev I went through every single piece of this house, took out everything that was good. I thought it was the end of the world was coming. You should have saw me. And it's such a wreck, Dave. It looked so nice in here too. It was so it, it it was just decorated just the way I want. This was my spare room. Luckily, I put these things up on shelves, so none of that stuff got damaged. It's just some crap. My art. This one's, not, so this one's not as bad. Dave, I'm planning on keeping this fine piece of furniture here. This one's not so bad, but I, I'm not putting it yeah. in my. Bed. Wait a minute. There's nothing wrong with this. A little. A little paint on this barn, and it'll be fixed as good well, as that mold. Do. I'm not touching. Oh, it's a piece of shit. I'm gonna throw it in the trash as quick as I can. These I made these. I, I gotta save my beach glass. This is all my beach glass that I. Well, I'm going to. I just gotta. Hang on a minute. I have brand new shoes up there. Yeah. Well, why don't above, we get? The, the, this is my. You gotta get him out of here before. Is, is this here. thing? Is this thing trash? Because this is a beautiful cabinet. I, this this one, one might. You might. If Harry gets a truck, this one's a might, piece of shit. You might be able, you might be able to save this one. If Harry gets a truck. There's a cedar. There's. A, can you open the bottom and see if there's? A, oh, there's paper towels. Um, just grab those. Um, How do you open the bottom? Just there, there, there's a. There, no, no, no. It, it's inside the. Um, yeah. There, there's there's a. Um, yeah, yeah. There's there's the handle right there. Yeah. You lift it up, and I had. Did it get wet on the bottom? No, yeah, it looks. Everything's wet. Yeah, insane, but the, 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 the what do you call it looks pretty good. Yeah, everything's... Oh, there's bugs in there and everything else. What kind of bugs? I don't know what it was. Put the light on in there. Like, there's no light in here. The house has no electricity. Been a natural disaster. Especially in this house. Water come up? Oh, here's my neighbor, Pete. Oh. oh, pretty high. Here, take a look. I can show you the high water mark. Come on in. Remember Is I it? No. No, that, 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 that's to the speaker system. All my valuables here. What about this cord? Is it this cord? Oh, that, that, that's important. Th this is important if we could salvage this one. What is it? It's, it's the thing that plugs into my display cases. What display case? Dave, you have to remember, I, 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 what I ransacked this place what display before the hurricane. Case? My, display, my, my, my display case is up front. You have to remember, I ransacked this place. Before. When they told us we had to evacuate, I went through and took everything that I had to take. And the rest, I said, is just 
shit, I'll just leave it here. If it if it gets ruined in Sandy, it gets ruined in Sandy. And guess what? It did. Look at all this mess. Here, wait. Hang on a minute, Dave. What I'm going to go through some of... Yeah, this is this good rain jacket I could save. Here, just what? grab that. Uh, grab that. I'm going to save this valuable bathing suit here. Finest from Target. Right. What that was These were the things that were salvaged out of 249 Sherman. Of course, everything has to be cleaned off. All these chairs need to be cleaned off. They're going to my rental apartment. I have two rentals here. Aside from my own unit. Here is my view. Just on DuPont Avenue. Bay block. 300 block. Looking down towards my gazebo. Over on this side. You can see Seaside Park. O Street. And K Court behind it. And then you can see all the way to um, the eastern shores of Bayville, Ocean Gate, I can see clearly. Dock Outfitters going on the other side of the gazebo. I can see Route 35 going south and Route 35, sorry, Route 37 going inbound into Tom's River. And Route 35 coming, Route 37 coming in and Route 35 going out. There's the, I can see all the way to the water tower. And I can see all the way to the ocean from here. If you look, you can see the, um, the orange things from the casino pier. And I'm taller than all the other houses. Seaside Park's water tower. Okay, people, this is the tour of the house. Here we open the door and we're greeted by our Jack Russell Terrier security system. Okay, you walk into house and you can go to the right or the left. I'm gonna take you down to the left right now. As you can see here, I have a cabinet to display things, which I don't have any of my own stuff in there just yet. That belongs to the owner of the house. Current owner. And then here's my French doors. These go out to a deck. And there's a little bit of a mess from the recent unpleasantness, but I can see over DuPont Avenue. This is my, and it's so pleasant because I can walk and look who follows me everywhere. Naturally, Miss Claudia follows me. I'm her favorite person in the whole world. Let's see here. And you go down. All right, so you turn back around, back through the French doors. We're going to continue our tour of the right. Then I have a big, giant closet here in the hallway. Jumbo for all my stuff. And I have uh, stuff that's going to go in there. I have plans for this closet. And then this table is just sitting here. This is my old table from 249 Sherman, where this is going to go into my rental unit, which is downstairs. And this is my keyboard that survived Hurricane Sandy. And look how good I am. Look, flat tips. If Lisa, my piano coach, is watching, or Dawn, my friend, who's a music director, she'll be so proud. Pro, practically. Okay, now, mind you, this, this bedroom is under construction, but here's my downstairs bedroom suite that, want, that I plan to use for my bedroom. Now, obviously, this room, this used to be Jillian Cameron's bedroom when she was a teenager, thus the paint job and the, it's like pink and purple and all different and black, but John is going to paint this, John Camera, white while I'm in Florida, and he's gonna put down a new Pergo floor there's the TV on the wall, and then a 
as you can see, there's a shelf, and then there's this space over here. This, so this is like a little studio apartment in itself. And you could see there's the bed. Sorry, th th this is the bed frame. I just bought a queen size mattress for there, and that chair is courtesy of my brother's house, which is right next door to here. I borrowed it on a permanent loan. Now, oh, the this is the, the bathroom, but the light isn't working. I don't know if you can see the light is out from the top, but this is a full-size bath, and this is down in my bedroom. This is my downstairs bedroom suite, and then you walk in over here. Now, this is all Jillian stuff that John's getting out of here, and he's going to paint the thing, but I have a walk-in closet. Now, mind you, this was a teenager's room that moved out. It been, hasn't been occupied in five years. Just Jillian's old bedroom. Then you can go back over here and I have the two windows and you can see it from this angle. And then we go back out into the other room. Now we are walking back towards the other side of the house. The other side of here. This again is the front door where you come in, the brown doors. And past that cabinet again. And this is what I call my little bonus living room. It's um it's just a bonus area and I have a couch that I just got that's going to go here and this is some of my furnishings that survived Hurricane Sandy and a little bit of a just to move that out of the way but to come out here there's another set of French doors and there's another deck that looks out over Bay Boulevard and you could see all the way to the bridge I'll show you the bridge when we get upstairs I can see all the way to Bayville and Ocean Gate, and I'm overlooking uh, Bay Boulevard on this side, on the DuPont side. And it really is a swanky setup, to say the least. And then there's my brother's house, right there. Zoom in on it. He lives two doors down from me here on Bay Boulevard. Now I'm walking back into my bonus living room that I have and in the bonus living room is a coat closet this big coat closet that's big and then now I walk into there's like a foyer area here and I have my survived I survived Hurricane Sandy furniture pieces in here this, this is an antique table I mean, an antique chair that I had refinished once. And this came from Curly's. I don't know if I mentioned this in a previous video. This came from Curly's, the house of ill repute of Seaside. So, now we're turning around. And now we're going up the stairs to the third floor. You walk up. And right in front of you is the refrigerator. And I just, the refrigerator was full of mold due to the recent unpleasantness but as you can see I have cleaned it all out like new. I took every piece of this thing out and soaked them in bleach in the bathtub because I don't want any mold in my refrigerator. Yuck. And then panning around there's the galley kitchen looks like granite uh, countertops but they're more of a you know a resin material it's all like I get like I said this has to be cleaned up yet I'm still in the process of doing it all and then in the center of the kitchen there's John's baby's thing because they have four kids little four little kids and then in my island and then there's another room this has room for a couch up here too I have a couch that's going to go there with its name on it. And then I have twin closets on either side of my uh, book. It's uh, like a window seat. And I have twin closets on both sides. And of course my dining room area. And then there is the liquor closet. And then you walk out. And this is the best part of the house. This is the night view from upstairs. But what I think is the coolest part 
of this whole house is this. Which is the view all the way to the J. Stanley Tunney Bridge. Okay, heading back into the upstairs portion of the house. Now, back here, in this area, now mind you, this, has, this is expecting new carpet and a new paint job too, but is the upstairs bedroom suite, which is a movie theater. As you can see, it's a huge room. That's the angle of the gable of the top of the house. All the house are all gables. And then there's a, a skylight there and as you can see the shelving area has a projector and a sound system and it projects onto a movie screen that's built onto the wall and of course there's windows here and you can see all the way to the ocean from here I don't know if you can see out there I can see the water park it's all lit up then, of course, you turn around in this room and there's a closet, which I guess needs a curtain over it. This place is all getting, it's getting a Purgo floor. It has uh, Berber carpet. I don't like Berber carpet. And uh, it's getting laminate. And this is a giant suite that, oh, like another studio apartment almost. And um, it, this is where the galley would go. If you had a studio apartment, this is what it used to be. Um, and there's the bathroom. Bathroom's a little disheveled right now, but it's a full bath. My bottle of bleach I'm trying to clean. And then looking back in through. The house and back. And I, I have a plan for art on all of these walls. I have a specific um, program that I'm putting up of pictures. Something to do with Seaside Heights. I'll give you a hint. You can see it from here. And this is the angle of the room from the other side. And then we'll go back down the stairs. You can see it from this angle. All my salvaged furniture and my bonus area and my outdoor deck. And back to the main front door. Now that's the way the cookie crumbles at 102 Bay Boulevard. And uh, that's that.